All right, so this is another of my uh, awesome concoctions. I basically make the uh, dollar store cappuccino. So I've got some ice in there, and then it's got some of this uh, chocolate peanut butter, PB2. It's not really a dollar store, it's four bucks, but you get a whole bunch of servings out of there for four bucks. And then some cheap instant coffee. And now I just tried this uh, cashew milk, which seems basically like almond milk, but maybe a little bit different. And I'll just put that in to taste. Or whatever you'd say if I could pour it while I'm filming and uh, it's all about the ratio of ice to soy milk or almond milk or uh, cashew milk in this case or regular milk I guess to uh, what kind of consistency you want it so put in a little bit more liquid it's gonna be easy like more like a, a milkshake and if you put in less liquid it'll make it more like a frappuccino from Starbucks but you get some little bit of protein in there, you get a little bit of flavor from the chocolate, and then the coffee uh, comes out like a uh, frappuccino from Starbucks. Here, let's uh, pause it and let the magic happen. Now it was pretty thick, so I went ahead and added a bit more milk. And you can see it, I think it just blends so much air in there, being so fast, that uh, you have to kind of shake it up. So I'm going to continue to do that. So now, even with quite a bit of fluid in there, quite a bit of the milk, it'll still get to the best spot. There we go. It'll get to a dead spot where it's basically fluffed all the ice up to the edges and the blades are just spinning. So we'll open that up. And it comes out nice and thick like a uh, store-bought frappuccino. Stick a spoon in here. And very much the consistency. It doesn't have the chemicals that keep it in suspension, so it'll start to melt a little sooner, but you've got just a few chemical or just a few uh, ingredients in there. The cashew milk which has however many ingredients basically just dried up coffee and uh, peanut butter with uh, some chocolate in it ends up tasting pretty darn good and uh, again if you wanted even a little bit more liquidy uh, you can get it to be more like a chocolate milk and uh, this is more like a melting frappuccino from Starbucks but uh, real cheap and for what four or five six seven bucks uh, I get quite a few of them out of here and uh, all you really need is an ice machine and a blender this is a fancy blender so it probably does a little bit better job or quicker job than a regular blender but uh, you get the point across. So that's the uh, dollar store cappuccino. Let us know what you think. As always, thanks for watching.